Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello viewers. Assalamu alaikum. I am Alamgir Ahmed. Today I will show how to create a rain effect on Adobe Photoshop. I am using Adobe Photoshop CS version. If you want to using another version, so as you like. But I am using those brush. Four two zero four and nine double six and four three eight. Four three eight. If you want to using those brush, you can look video description then download. So first I am using one image. The un I will group it because here something text. Yeah okay. So then I will unlock this layer. Matching this as here big and here small. Yeah, okay. So right now select quick selection tool. already finished my selecting then I will click here layer mask so finish uh, background right now I will click on new blank layer and put it this layer and again select paint bucket tool. sorry paint bucket tools then I am using this color if you want to using another color no problem so put it this color select layer 1 and right click then select blending option and select gradient overlay gradient is black and white and style is radial check it okay now I will select layer 0 and I will copy that press ctrl J and rename this layer backup put it this under one then I will select my original layer then only select layer mask white then right click apply layer mask then I go to image option select adjustment then shadow highlights so shadow amount is 0 and tunnel width 57 and radius is 0 amount is uh, highlight amount is 48 56 I think this one good or 54 and 
95 no 96 then click here okay then I will select layer 0 and I will click uh, I will create a new blank layer then I will select brush tools and I am using 4204 click a little bit option and 76 yeah good and specific 21 percent this is good click here shape dynamic size jitter 100 percent and angle jitter 100 percent then okay press here oh sorry color is only white Only white. Then again, I will create a new blank layer, and this layer, sorry, rename rain one. I will select again brush tools, and this time I'm using nine double six. So, oh, sorry, I will. 5000 yeah this is good then press control G I will matching that apply okay After that, I go to filter uh, filter option. Filter option, select filter option and blur and motion blur. This time I'm using 65 and 130, 130. Yeah, this is good. And opacity change. Okay. After that, I will create a new blank layer, and this layer name is Rain Two. And again, I will select Brush Tools. This time, I'm using um, Four Three H. So try it. <coughs> then I go to again filter option and blur and motion blur then same blur okay then again create a new blank layer then I will select paint bucket tool uh, sorry paint bucket tools I will select pen packet tools block block color then I go to <coughs> put it this color and I go to filter option and select noise then add noise this one one it one point 20 G and check it then okay 
then I will select again filter option blur and motion blur I am using this time distance is 1563 or 64 then ok then change the screen opacity change so if you want to using soft light yeah this is good ok after that I will select layer 3 then right click and blending option and hold the uh, all check key uh, all check key then one uh, 255 and 255 then here 48 then okay then I will create again new blank layer and pen bucket tools and same process click here then filter option noise add noise this time using 98.90 I think this is good yeah okay then filter option and blur motion blur this time using only 17 is distance distance is 17 then press ok then I go to image option and adjustment then select levels this time using only middle 0 0.42 and this is one 245 yeah this is good then press ok but 255 ok change screen and opacity decrease 40 yeah this is good then I will click, uh, click layer 1 and um, I will create a new adjustment layer a new adjustment layer and select curves this time using curves is 150 and 113 this is good ok then I will, uh, I will selecting brush tools and Black, selecting black color then I will remove layer mask brush but I am using regular circle I will remove layer mask yeah ok then I will select layer, z uh, layer 0 and select uh, adjustment new adjustment layer then select high saturation hue saturation and right click and create uh, click here create clipping mask I am using this term only saturation is minus 24 or 24 120 yeah this is good ok <coughs> right now I will select layer 4 and create a new again blank layer then I will press ctrl shift alter E ctrl shift alter E after that I go to image option select adjustment then <coughs> shadow highlights so amount is 0 uh, shadow amount is 0 tunnel width 57 and radius 0 but highlights amount is 55 and tunnel width uh, 56 66 and radius is 952 
This is good then press up now oh, sorry 952 then press ok then select layer 5 and I will copy that uh, copy this layer press ctrl J copy all <coughs> then select filter option and uh, filter option then uh, filter gallery yes, select plastic warps jump out so highlight is 5 this is good and details is age and 9 is smoothness this is good then uh, hit ok Now I will create a new layer mask. So click here, select uh, color black and capacity uh, opacity is 40, 47 or 48. Yeah, okay. So finish <coughs> but after that I will select new adjustment to layer and click here color balance so it is 11 and yeah sound red minus 11 Minus 11, sun red, then yellow, blue, um, plus 50. Yeah, this is good. Then shadow, select shadow, sun red, plus 6. Sorry, six and yeah, blue nineteen. I think nineteen. Eight. Nineteen eight. good or nineteen. Or ten. Eleven. Yeah, this is good. Sorry, my computer is very slow. That's for So sorry yeah then select highlights sun red is minus 11 and blue I think 10 no 20 this one looking good so thanks for everyone watching this tutorial and I can hope everyone subscribe my channel so thank you for your time I love you